Wild man. If I throw this to you, will you catch it? <laughs> Let's see what happens. After threatening to film some BMX for several years, I made it down to the wetlands for a session. It already seems like there's a huge crew stacking up. Seven feet tall, and these jumps are taller than me. Got Wild Man here now showing me the B line, the beer run line, smaller jumps for those that can't brave the big jumps. It's still big though. They're not big, big. It's like a six footer or eight footer. Dude, those are really pretty big. I don't know what they're talking about, little. David, what'd you- went well, I guess. Guys, when I lived in a shed 10 years ago, David came and stayed with me, ran into him here at the trails. You know, I was, I was homeless, and you know, this guy brought me in. He's a great guy. You should, you should watch more of his videos, for sure. <laughs> Your first lap through the trails, what'd you think? Uh, it's sick. They ride really good, but you know, first lap's always so hairy. But survival is the key, so I'm gonna try to go figure it out some more. See you on the next one. <laughs> I missed that whole thing, by the way. Oh. Oh crap, David take two. How are you feeling about these jumps? Well, wow, these trails are the best trails I've ever hit in my life. I've only hit one run through. It's the best run ever. There you go, man. What's your name? Shane O'Hara. Shane O'Hara hitting the jumps. the crew on this beautiful Wednesday evening. The winds aren't too strong. The sun's about to set. So let's see what happens. Can when you 
can just throw a couple water like better than anything else I've ever seen. <laughs> you laps in, David, how are you feeling? Uh, I love them. They're so good. It's yeah. very, very, very fun. We're going to see any cool tricks out of you? Uh, unlikely. I'm just having too much fun just throwing whips and trying to land smooth. I saw Dustin <laughs> over there on the back jump. Oh, that was kind of just like no, a reflex. No. Like sometimes no, when I'm it's scared, it's like. Go. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> good. Much water. Good to be scared. But we'll just broom up a little. <laughs> yeah. Oh, did you hear that knuckle poppage? Down here, hanging out by the last big jump, shooting 120, hoping I catch some uh, sweet tricks on the booter. Haven't shot my camera at 120 frames a second before, so uh, let's see what it turns out like, eh? Cannot overstate how big these jumps are. Get a load of just looking at this berm. Things straight, straight up and down. Here comes David. We got wild man shooting from the sidelines, doing better work than I am. Let's see the shot. Old David Lieb right there. Gonna put me clean out of business. What well, can you guys tell me about the activities that are occurring at this place right now? Look at your thing, man. Look at that microphone. Look like at that setup. Are you a cameraman? <laughs> <laughs> David said if I get in position, he's gonna do 360 tabletop here on the final jump. Oh, that was a... Felt better. I'm gonna check the footy. Wild man, if I throw this to you, will you catch it? Let's see what happens. Let's get that three table. Close enough. Still on? Uh, I think. David, I think my work here is done, dude. No way. Most pleased? Cool. <laughs> Most pleased, for sure. Tom did a great job. Oh, good. <laughs> the session's coming to end here at the Wetlands. Big thanks to Anthony Napolitan for letting me come out and film and troll around, get some clips. So, as always, have a nice time and have a nice day. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. High octane, dude. Just when you thought the drum was going. Going street.